up y'all it's your girl Brenda Giz, and I'm in a car I'm about to uh, go to Target real quick so I will be back shortly hey guys what is up I had to um, run a jewels really quick to pick up some items because I'm about to cook some spaghetti and um, what else I said was on cook hold on one second yeah, so I said I was going to cook some spaghetti, so I ended up getting some Garrett popcorn. Love that. Some sea salt pita crackers. I'm going to eat that with some tuna. I picked up some herb seasoning croutons for my Caesar salad. Some Rails homemade spaghetti. I'm about to cook that now. Then I picked up some soda, some uh, Starry. This is pretty good. Um, a Coke. Every now and then I have a taste for dark pop. I need to get off the pop because my belly is getting big. And some Sprite. Yes, girl, that belly. When you drink that pop, that belly get big, honey. You need to get rid of that. Another Sprite. And the only reason why I got it because it was like four, one forty nine. Some strawberry Eggo waffles. My ground beef for my spaghetti. Some, some honey ham turkey meat. No, I'm sorry, honey ham lunch meat. I bought four, and I bought the Rails homemade mushroom and bell pepper. Um, spaghetti sauce. This is the vodka sauce. I don't know how that tastes, but we shall see. And then some Hellman's. You know, check your receipts because they weren't ringing up my stuff right. Caesar salad, even though it's jewels. I think, um, one of the supervisors at my job, she told me to try the sweet Italian. I think this is the one from Marzetti's. She said it's really good. So I'm gonna try it, and I also got a Caesar just in case. Along with some uh, a bell pepper, yellow pepper, and red pepper to go in my spaghetti. And some onions. Yeah, I was going to Target, but I didn't really need to go. I could have went, but I remembered I love to get some fruit from um, Jules. The three for twelve. I hope. I hope the um. You do it right. Right. That goes. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, okay. What you gonna do with that? Then we have watermelon. This one's not closed either. I don't know where it's left. Let me put this in the kitchen. Then a lactate eggnog and the regular milk. Grape, cranberry, and cran pomegranate. And that is about it, girls. That's all I I, re I really went to get some um ground beef. So I can make this spaghetti. So I'm about to go wash my hands and get busy making my food. So I just added some uh, onions into it, and I'm gonna put my ground beef wherever is that girl. Okay, and then I have my ground beef. I'm gonna cut up my peppers because I just washed them.
Okay, so I added the sauce and it looks delicious. So I'm gonna let that cook. And I just added a little bit of um, chili sauce to it. Tastes good to me. Be back. Alright, beauties, I am finished cooking. I made some Brussels sprouts, some steam fresh Brussels sprouts, some spaghetti real quick, and some hot water cornbread. I don't usually make hot water cornbread. That is my mother's specialty. She is like a pro at it. And I think my cousin Chastity is really good at it as well. But um, I was doing something real quick. But let me show y'all my food. Okay, this is my food. And I know it's good. I can, I can tell it's good. And so I'm about to pour me up some. Uh, I, I got a taste for some Coke. A Coca-Cola. And I'm going to enjoy the rest of this evening. And I'll see y'all later. Bye. Love y'all. Beauties, what is up? It's your girl, Brandy Giz. I just came from uh, the dentist's office again. Yes. Again, we ain't gonna talk about that right now. But that's probably why my mouth is... That's probably why my mouth is moving the way it is. But I stopped in Sephora to pick up a couple of items as if I needed it. I wish I would have purchased it during the sale. But it's okay. Um... Girl, I ran into a supporter, a sister, a chat town sister. Her name is Pretty Girl Glam. I ran into her. It was nice meeting her. I'm glad she said something. Girl, sometimes it's just like you make videos. You don't be thinking nobody recognizes you, child. But it's cool. And I see they got a new uh, Akira store. I'm going to stop in there real quick. So I do have some shoes on hold but i don't think i'm gonna get them because they're kind of like summer summer spring but let's go into akira and see what they have and i also picked up a uh, cinnabon them things went up seven dollars let's go ahead slippers then he told me about some seal got my cinnabon my little mini sephora haul huh? what they got cyber week hey, this is their cyber week y'all i need to go get my nails done because they're looking hideous okay i'm hungry too what, what can i eat what can i eat they get my favorite little restaurant over there but they take too long and it's a friday yeah we gonna do that. So let's go home. Hey beauties, what is up? Hey beauties, what is up? I just got got back. I actually came home and I ate my covers. I don't usually go to Culver's, but today I did. I wanted a burger, and then I seen some um, shrimp, some fried shrimp. Ooh, I got that just in case. It was really, really good, y'all. So, yes, I'm at home. Y'all see I'm in my little lounge clothes because I had a appointment, and then uh, later I went just shopping just a little bit a little retail therapy and I went to go get my nails done because they was looking hideous I went to go get my feet done I got orange on my toes with French on the rest of them but anyway let me stop touching hold on one second okay beauty so I'm back and I went to Akira I had bought this little bag for um 
I think it was like 74 cent. I thought this was the cutest. Yeah, 74 cent. I don't usually buy bags, but if I'm gonna buy a bag, it gotta be cute. So let me show you what I picked up when I went to Akira. These cute little rhinestone house shoes and they are $19.90, but I got them for $10. So I went to the pre Black Friday sale. Somebody that worked there hooked me up and I was able to shop for time. So these are the Azalea Wang. These are so cute. And I got them in large. I actually wanted an extra large because you know my big feet I wear a size nine and a half, ten. And I was gonna get uh like two more pairs, but bigger size for family members for you know Christmas, but it didn't work out like that. But I'll show y'all how they look. They are super cute. Yes, I'm gonna show y'all how they look in a few minutes. And what else did I buy? Oh I found this sweater and it was like 30% off. This was 50% off the shoes. Every, everything else was an additional 30% off. So I grabbed this pretty like pink sweater. You guys know I love. I love the detail on this sweater. Super cute. I love me a sweater. This is really, really cute. This is also by Akira. And it's not too like thick where you get real hot. This one right here is just amazing. It is so soft. I love the colors, the detail. It has that yellow, then that pretty like baby powder blue. But it fits so cute. And look at the buttons, y'all. Look at the buttons. So, so cute. I hope y'all can see these buttons. Looks like it has like a rhinestone and a pearl. But it is so cute, y'all. And I can wear this to work with some cute little trousers. I love the feel of it. It's so soft. Okay, moving on. I tried this in the dressing room. I don't know if I recorded it, but I tried this little one piece jumper in the dressing room. And it's something like a knit, kind of like sweater, but it's different. And it has like that halter. I tried it in a medium. It was a little bit, it fit, but I didn't want it to fit like that. I, I needed a large. So I ended up getting a large and I could see myself wearing this with like a like a over oversized white shirt or something like that. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, I thought this was different. So I got it. And it just says A B C D E A B C D all over girl. Something different. And the last item that I picked out was this because I can wear it with like if I'm going on errands to the doctor wherever the case may be and I can wear them with uh, like a big uh, one of my big oversized sweaters but this is like a jumper yeah it's an everyday and I got it in the size medium large I haven't tried it on so I hope I can fit it but that's all that I picked up when I went to Akira I also went to the bakery for my mom because she wanted some um she wanted some like muffins and donuts and stuff. And so I went to the bakery for her and I brought my son a, uh oh, this stuck to the paper. I brought my son a red velvet cake or cupcake. Put that right there. I'm gonna try this on camera. This is like their apple pie, caramel apple pie something. She says sweet, so I better get ready. Let me get my water. Hold on. Okay, I got my water. We're going to see how this tastes. She said it was good, but it don't look good. But I wanted to try it. So let's see. Bless the food, Father. I'm about to receive. Take any impurities out that don't belong. Let it be fit for this temple in which you reside. And all these things I pray in your son. Jesus Christ, name, amen. Ooh. Oh, this is good. I'm dropping it, y'all. Mm, I'm gonna put that away. That is good. Let me get some paper towel. Yes, girl, that was good. Girl, God is so good. He is so amazing. I love him. Girl. So 
so I heard some good news on the way home. Oh, my mama called me and I don't share everything with you all, but I can share a praise report. I just want to give God the glory for he is wonderful. He is awesome. If you don't know him, I suggest you try him. Uh, yesterday, well, this whole week we were um, contacted by um, family in Alabama. I have an older brother who lives in Alabama. And he um, went to the hospital, went to the hospital, well, I'm not going to tell all his business, but I can say he went to the hospital and they kept him. They seen some things and it was taking a turn, y'all. But the God that I serve, he resurrected that, that boy. <laughs> he went from being comatose, in a coma, tubes all down him. You know, just how an MICU patient looks from like, you know, how you see a patient like CCU patient or MICU patient. In any event, girl. God is amazing. My brother is up and talking, my mother said. And I am so, so thankful, so grateful. I've been praying for him. It, You know, when the enemy comes in, like a flood, he'll lift up a standard. And I was just thinking to myself, like, because I was at work when I heard the news. And I don't know about y'all, but, like, when the enemy start messing with family, you know, and close friends and whatnot, or you yourself, I always was taught to go in go in so I was like okay it's time for me to go to war and what that means is I go in in prayer and I just shut out everything everyone and I go in I, I went in when I was in the car I was just praying and you know decreeing and declaring God you said in your word you know so I'm so grateful I'm so thankful and this is you know clothes all of that stuff they don't mean nothing it's fun to have it's cool to have um makeup is nice to have but we live in a real world and this is real stuff that takes place and you just got to be rooted and grounded and i just thank god for bringing him out of that coma i love my brother eric and um yeah the best is just to come so but that being said i just want to say that to you all so if you're going through something like like sickness or whatever the case may be just give it to god and you know just trust him don't like once you give it to him take it back you just gotta believe that you will receive whatever you're asking for it's just a matter of believing so that's what that was on my plate and i thank god for bringing him through yes so um what else did i want oh i did go to sephora and I told you guys I met a subscriber. She um, follows me on um, YouTube. I follow, not YouTube, Instagram. I follow her too because she's very, very pretty. Tall, just like model. She's just like one of those girls that's like, girl, you got your stuff. <laughs> girl, you doing it. Her name is Pretty Girl Glam. If you want to go for, I don't know if she wants you all to follow her, but you know, she's just that girl with the flat glasses and she coming up in there like, is you pretty? Yes. <laughs> I'm just it was fun it was funny i had just came from the dentist and i was just like oh my god i can't even smile the way i want to smile but i was so so happy that she stopped stopped me i don't feel like no nobody big or anything girl i'm just a regular schmegler girl that was in the store shopping and i seen her and if anything she needs to make a youtube channel because she got all the fashion and beauty and stuff like that but uh, anyway i was watching i've been watching people's channel and they've been talking about this uh danessa myrick's beauty it's the yummy skin serum skin tint looks like this i've been seeing a lot of this even when the sephora sale was going on unfortunately i didn't pick it up which i should have but i didn't see it when i went to oakbrook you know but when i went to orland i finally seen it they got like a whole display but she matched me this shade was i want to say it was dark but this shade was like the 11 so i end up getting the shade 11 let me open it up for y'all and this like i said is a skin tint it looked pretty in in the store when she um tried it on me this is the packaging real cute kind of remind me of like fashion fair packaging 
but I don't want to insult nobody but yeah this is something that I can wear like every day when I'm going to work because I don't like a heavy foundation it's just something that I don't like and then I was looking for another bronzer because I like to put bronze on my lid you know I don't be knowing how to contour and all that stuff but I just do a little something something so I got the fancy I was gonna get Mario but Mario was looking a little orangey red on the side so maybe I just got the wrong shade I'm gonna keep you know looking and seeing but for now I got the Fenty Sun Stalker and this is in the shade Coco Naughty I just got my nails done girl girl when I did a when I did my nails it was cute the first time but the second time I was like what the world was I doing so this is the packaging real cute and here it is the color hopefully you guys can see that so I am excited to try this I put it on my lids earlier and the last thing that I picked out is a lip gloss I wanted the one from Patrick Ta and it was a really pretty one it looked kind of like a lip oil with a little tint but they ran out of those so I got the Pat McGrath and this is in the shade New Venus that's the packaging y'all New Venus and this is the color I always get the same old colors but it's really pretty I think this will look good with a lip liner probably like um the one I just bought that's upstairs that I I'm not going all the way upstairs to get but I do want to tell y'all go out and get these elf these elf uh lip gloss lip lip oils they are bomb y'all this one right here it's in the shade oh shoot I can't even see it it's in let me look in this mirror, this light I don't know it's the new one really pretty get this one or you can get the um other one that is like a pink tint these are bomb these are like every day for those girls that like lip gloss if you got a teenager this would be cute you know they like to have their lips popping and stuff so get those from elf they were only like eight bucks i'm gonna try this lip gloss on so that you guys can see you can see how it looks what lip liner says this is vino i really don't want to wear it with vino it's just like a I don't want it to be too red. Let's see. Tone it down a little bit. Okay. Tone it down a little bit. Then we're going to put this on. Ooh. Pat my graph lip gloss and smell good. Okay, I'm a little oily, but this is it. It's cute. I like it. I hope I don't have it already, girl. But I love me some lip glosses. Okay. Put this back in here. Okay, y'all want to see the clothing that I purchased? Y'all probably want to see the color. Okay, let me um, well, let me show y'all the sweater. Okay, this I got in an extra large because I didn't want it to be too fitted, too tight. You guys know sometimes when I um, wash clothes, I mistakenly throw it in a wash the dryer. So this is super cute. I love me a bright sweater and I can wear it with some, some trousers. So yeah, I like. That's the first one. I didn't need it, but I got it. 
this sweater I love it is so pretty it's soft it looks so luxe it just screams just classy but this is a really nice sweater I don't know what I'm gonna wear it with but I do love it it is so cute now that was made or you can button it up you can wear like all like some black slacks or some gray slacks this is so pretty I thought it was three but but I guess it's two but yeah isn't that cute try not to look at the, the uh, you know the t-shirt but it goes all the way down y'all know I got long arms and I love it's so pretty it's different it's different i didn't get any of the shoes that they had they had some cute shoes but i don't know girl i don't even have nowhere to put this stuff i don't even have nowhere to put this right here but i had to get it because it was i love a sale 30 percent off but if i had some bro i had put some shoes up at um what's that place macy's i didn't even go back and get them i wanted them but i ain't need them but this is like a really pretty I actually feel like an animal. Okay, and y'all seen this. So I don't need to show y'all that, right? And this was really, really cute. And I'm not gonna I'm not gonna even try on the jumper because y'all see that in an upcoming video when I wear it with like a sweater. But y'all know how this looks. So that will complete this here video. I hope you all enjoyed. It was, it was a quick haul. I am gonna go finish the rest of my um, snack, my meal. And yeah, girl, that is about it. Close up my purse, put this upstairs in the bedroom. And yeah, girl, I'm about to get off of here. I thank you all for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe to your channel, just like my shirt say, just do it. Just subscribe, girl. It's free, it won't cost you a dime, okay? Bye, y'all, love y'all. Oh yeah, I forgot to show y'all the um the slippers, right? These are the slippers that I um got from Akira.